All right, I presented my big brother with some egg here. Selfie. You know, you have cameras, right? It's okay, I forgot. I don't know where my right. thing is, so we're going to use phone's downstairs. That's a lot of work right now. All right. And Are you ready? Go. All right. First of all, environmental, not bad. I mean, could use a better entrance. No one sat me down. I had to seat myself. <laughs> it's kind of an issue. There's no sign outside about the restaurant, where this it is, is what's house. going on. So please don't interrupt. All right. Okay. I'll dock a point for that. The customer's always right. So if you're going to argue with me, I mean, I'm docking points right away. We're in his house. So I have to start over now. There is no sign outside. I don't know where the restaurant is. Nobody seated me. I had to sit myself. Okay. Uh, there's no napkins, no forks. Nobody brought some water. No one asked me if I wanted water. I wasn't given an appetizer. Is this the appetizer? Is this the dinner? This is, is this the, the main entree? This is the main. Okay. Nobody Brendan. asked me for water. Nobody asked me if I I wanted to see. Nobody asked that. me how I was day. Nobody asked me how my day was going. If I if I had been helped yet. Sir, can I tell you? Please don't interrupt again. Okay. <laughs> You're on your last straw. Okay. <laughs> Moving on. Moving on. I mean, we, the the most at this point we can score is about a six. Okay. I'm just letting you know next time, okay? Please may I interject. No. Please please save all questions for the end. Okay, I'm now seated. Um, I still don't have any water. Do you like the bag? Again, I, I still don't have any water. Sir, I'm the owner. Just okay. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, again, I, I again I'm gonna make sure that your restaurant burns to the ground. <laughs> but you see no success, okay? Good presentation as far as color goes. Um, I do want to know what's going into my stuff here. It looks like we got some hummus on here. Eggs, I'm all for those two things. I see pesto. That was a personal touch. I like that. Whoever your chef is added to the entree. I like that. One thing I will explain about the dressing here. I mean, if I don't know what went into the dressing, there's probably some sort of uh, either high fructose. Thank you. Uh, I'll take with no ice, that's fine. I didn't want ice. I, I could have used ice, but that's fine. If you hopefully you ran the tap water. I'm assuming this is probably tap water. You didn't ask if I wanted a bottle or anything like that, that's fine. Okay. Uh, as far as what's going on into this third dressing here, and, and what I'm assuming is sriracha, which is a good touch. touch. Sriracha seems to have uh, really jumped off the map here in the last three to five years. Um, whatever this white sauce is, I don't know what's gone into it. I would like to know. It does say it's an avocado ranch sort of sauce or sauce over there. Um, it does not look like it was natural and made fresh, so I am seeing that there is some high fructose corn syrup or something going into that. Um, quinoa, also good natural touch. Um, let's go ahead and uh, take a look here. Okay. Eggs seem to be proportionately cooked all the way through. Okay, I noticed the quinoa, which is another good natural touch. Okay, texture. Uh, don't have a fork. That is an issue. There should be a knife. Excuse me, there should be a knife on the right-hand side. It's another docked point based on placement. Kind of limited in my tools here. Good music, though. Good music in the background. That's good. You guys did a good job there as far as you can think. <laughs> Smells good. Looks like it's fresh. It hasn't been sitting underneath the heat lamp, so I'm good with that as well. Okay, eggs are probably done a little bit overdone, just a little bit, not too much. There's a lot of flavors that went into this. Some, for some people that's good, for some people that's not so good. It can be overpowering. It can be too many things going on at one time. You got a mild sauce, of verde sauce, and then all of a sudden you kick it up with sriracha, and then you're trying to blend it with the hummus. For some people that might be a little bit too much. Um, overall, based on entrance, being seated, uh, lack of uh, politeness, Poor ownership skills and relationship with the owner. Um, presentation, taste, texture, and smell, and environment. I'm giving you about a five and a half overall out of ten. What? Sir, I will write in my review. I will write in my review tonight. We have a palate cleanser for you at the end. All right, all right. We just moved down to a four and a half. Out of, four and a half out of ten. So appreciate you trying. You guys can all go to hell. Go fuck yourselves. Thanks. I understand everything that I'm taking in. I, I mean, I've learned from her. So, yeah, I wasn't seated properly. Nobody told me where the sign was. There was no water. No one asked to see if I was helping.